Hi, I'm Matt from eSpares. In this video, I'll show you how to replace the door seal on a Zanussi washing machine. If you've identified a leak coming from your door seal, then it's likely that the seal has deteriorated, causing a hole or a split, or the seal is full of mold. Either way, it'll need to be replaced. Now, safety first, always disconnect an appliance before carrying out any work. Now to replace the door seal, I don't have to remove the door and the door hinge, but for ease of access, I'm going to do so. Simple to do, just undo the two screws that hold the hinge in place. With the door hinge and the door out of the way, we can now access the door seal easily. Now the seal is held in place on the outside of the machine by a plastic outer retaining band, which if you find the connection, you should just be able to pull it away easily. But you may have to use a flat headed screwdriver just to separate the two sets of teeth there. With that out of the way, we can loosen the door seal from the outside. And then it's a case of simply getting your fingers on top of the door seal but underneath the drum and then just pull the door seal away from the machine. Be aware though that the door seal is held in place inside by a sprung retaining band that should come away when you pull the seal towards you. Now bringing in our new door seal, this is the lip that goes around the edge of the tub here, this rim on the tub here. Now it can be very grippy because of course this is a silicon based rubber. So what I'm going to do is show you a little top tip, grab some washing up liquid and we're going to be using this as a lubricant. So I'm just going to work this around the lip here, which will just make it a lot easier to fit the door seal inside the washing machine. Now that the door seal is nicely lubricated with washing up liquid, I can fit it to the tub itself. The process is reasonably simple. I just have to lift up that lip and then wrap it around the edge of the tub. Now it can take a little bit of time, but do be patient with it. It's also worth pointing out that these two triangles here indicate the top of the seal. So they've got to remain at the top whilst fitting. Now that I'm happy that the door sill is in place on the tub, it's time to fit the inner band, the sprung band. Now, if your door seal isn't fitted correctly on the tub, this band will simply take the door seal off. So make sure that it's in place. This is also a good time to grab an extra body, an extra pair of hands to help you fit this, as it can take a lot of strength to stretch it round the seal and get it properly in position. Now that the spring band is fully in position and it's holding the door seal in place on the tub, I can now pull out the door seal and attach the outer lip to the outside of the washing machine before then refitting the plastic outer retaining band. Once the door seal is in place on the outside of your washing machine, you can then grab your outer retaining band, and feed that around the outside of the seal, and then clip the two connections together, and then just push as hard as you can, make sure that they're locked in place, and then you can refit the door and the door hinge.
With the hinge and the door now refitted, I'm just going to check the door, make sure that it locks correctly. So there we have it, one new door seal fitted to this Zanussi washing machine. Remember, spares and accessories for all the appliances around your home can be found on the eSpares website. Thanks for watching.